Hi there, back again. Only a small vlog this time. I know I said the next vlog would be the Madeira one, but as some of you know, if you'd seen our travel announcement, trip trip announcement, um, we're gonna go to Florida in September. So we're doing what everybody else does, although we've been there five, six times before, and we, we do know quite a bit. Um, you don't know everything. So we've been doing what everybody else does, watching everybody's YouTube channels, which we love watching everyone's YouTube channels when it comes to Florida and Disney and Orlando. Um, and we're getting hit, hints and tips. Now, we subscribe to Rick's Flicks on YouTube, his channel. If you go into Universal Studios Orlando, subscribe. I'll put the link to his YouTube channel in the description. The man's a genius, he knows everything. So we sat there and we was watching his vlog last night and, and it was the one where it's, I think it's 10 rookie mistakes that visitors for the first time make when visiting Universal Studios. On that vlog, he was showing that obviously you need to stay, stay, hydra de, uh, stay hydrated in the States, in Florida, because it's hot. If you don't, you'll feel ill, it'll spoil your holiday. So he basically shown that you could go to the, the food, little food outlets and the kiosks and ask for free water, and they'd give you a, a, a cold little cup of water, but it's, it's only a tiny one. And to be honest with you, I don't want to queue for a small water and I feel like a right tight ass queuing to get free water. But what Rick also said was and showed us that he's bought these little uh, silicon collapsible cups and the small, I think there's something like 250 mil. Um, I don't know what that is in fluid ounces, but the collapsible. And what he'd shown is you go to the Coke freestyle machines, press the button, water button, and you can top them up and the free. You're not queuing, you can drink it, collapse the thing up, up to your uncle. If you don't know what a freestyle coat machine is, I think they do, they'll probably even do them in the UK, some of these uh, theme parks. But it's a coat machine. You go to a kiosk, you get a mug, pay for a mug, and you pay something like $17 for, I think, I don't know if $17 a day, or you can do it for two days or three days. And while that is activated, you can go up, get coke, juice, whatever you want, as many times as you want. Now, the water in the machines are free, so obviously Rick's picked up on that, but one of these mugs, fantastic idea. Now, he got this from Amazon, obviously in the States. So, last night I looked, and they do, Amazon do them, um, eBay do them, but they're a bit small for, for me. Um, so, I've done a bit more looking around and it's I came across these things. Now these are, let me just see, these are 16 fluid ounces or UK, um, I think it's 470 mil. So the twice the size as the ones Rick was showing, which some people don't want a small one, but to me if you're getting a drink, I want a drink. Now, the sell cheaper versions of these on eBay and Amazon, but read the reviews because I nearly bought some, but the leak. Now this one is a branded one. This is um, this is by uh, Stojo, and it's the Stojo Biggie Collapsible Cup. Now, you can get them on eBay and £3.25 plus, £3, no they're not, I wish they were, £13.25. £3.25 postage, so you're only paying £16.50, which is a bit expensive. Carried on looking, and Argos, as I'm recording this now, which is about the 4th of May, and as of today, Argos are doing these reduced from £11.25 each to £7.50. They are selling out. I bought the last blue one and the last green one, our local Argos, today, those are the last ones. 
I think they had a grey one and a black, or a few grey ones, a few black ones left. But if you're interested in them, Argos, but do it quickly because they're selling out. I think people are buying them for summer. But they're fantastic. Well, I'm not sponsored by um, Stojo. It's just, I think they're brilliant. And if you're going to Florida, or if, even if you're not going to Florida, they're ideal for just taking around. Now, I'll show you how they work in a minute, but we used to carry these around. We used to go around Disney, the four of us, and we all had one of these each. They're brilliant. Aluminium, put freezing cold water in up, boiling up, whatever you want, and it stays either hot or cold. And it does it for well over 24 hours. Um, they're fantastic. The only thing is, empty, they're a bit heavy. Full, they're even heavier. There's two or three or a family of four, all got these in your rucksack, full of drink, they're heavy as hell. So, and, and also universal, you're putting stuff in lockers because you're going on rides. It's just the size of them. They were brilliant. I might be wrong, you comment below if I am. Disney, you were fine taking these through. You go through security and they were fine. When we went to Universal last year, and we, we didn't take these into Universal, we took bottles of water and um, security would take them off us. The one let's take bottles through. I don't know if that's changed, but like I said, bear that in mind. These things you take through empty and you just top up and get your free water. So, my opinion, these are brilliant, but not great for parks. These are fantastic. So, I'll show you how these work. You've got, that's still in the packet. That one, I took out the packet because I was worried if it, it, it tastes it taste the silicon. So I thought, if it does, I can take them back and I'll leave that one in the packet. Wash them out and it's fantastic. You can't taste anything. So don't worry about the, the bit of the taint flavor wise because it done. Now, you've got a straw. Straw comes out. You've got a little clip thing there that you pull out, turn, and that goes in the hole. And it goes in quite tightly. So that's not gonna leak. Like I said, be careful if you go on Amazon and eBay, the do ones that aren't branded and check the reviews because you could probably get them for about, I think some of them are about four quid, uh, four pounds. And then um, the reviews were, you're best off buying something decent rather than buying something that leaks and having to replace it. But um, I said, these are Stojo. Like I said, right. So what you do is take your straw off, bung the hole. Unscrew the lid, take that retainer off, the Stojo retainer, you take that off, that's just basically to give you a bit of grip when you hold it, because if, if that ain't on, it's like that. So you take that off, and then all you do is just push it in. That's amazing. So put your lid back on. Like that. Put the retainer that way around into the base. And that's it. So when these are in use, they fit in your bag. They're not gonna, you're probably gonna have a bit of fluid in there, you never know, still a bit of your drink left, but it's not gonna leak. And they fold into that. That's probably about what? Probably an inch and a half, two inches. Well, otherwise you'd be carrying that thing around. I mean, granted, you keep topping that up, but you probably get the amount of fluid you probably get when that's full. It's probably twice as much in that, but you're carrying it around. So that's that, all collapsed, which is brilliant. Then when you're ready to use it again, you've got to unscrew it. Obviously, otherwise it's a vacuum and suction in science. Um, unscrew it, take the retainer out, I'm calling it a return, it's, I don't know what it is, just a grippy thing. And then, do that again. Stick that back on there, solid. Put your lid back on, fantastic. Move that back, put your straw in, and you're ready to go. So, like I said, 
do what I'm going to do in the vlog, but I just found these interesting. At the minute, they've got my Argos cheap, so I want to tell you about them now. Not sponsored by, I'm not sponsored, obviously not sponsored by Argos. Wouldn't it be brilliant if you're sponsored by Argos? But um, I'll tell you about them now because they're cheap and these are fantastic. And if you want one, I want you to get it at the bargain price at Argos. But like I said, they seem to be selling out quick. I don't know what your stores are like, wherever you are, but they're selling out quick. So I hope you found it interesting. Um, if I find out else what I think's in use, I'll put it on here. If you don't find it interesting, you don't have to watch it. If you do, I'm, I'm glad you do. It's uh, just want to help people out, really. So, thank you, thank you for watching. I do, I do promise you, the next vlog will be the Madeira one. I haven't started editing it yet, um, but I'll have to cut out all the swearing due to that travel day because let's just say I was a little bit touchy. But you will be after a three-day travel day. But Hopefully the next vlog will be Madeira, unless I found something else interesting. Thanks for watching, hit the notification bell, I'll point up there but I, I don't know how to do that so just hit the notification bell, um, subscribe, comment, let us know if they still let you take water into Universal, if you've got something like this or even better than this, let us know in the description below, not description, comment, this all YouTube thing is really confusing but Thank you for watching. Join us again. Science. It's not really freeze frame neither because I don't know how to do that. Bye. Somebody at the door now.